Guys, this is Spirit here, and I'm here to tell you about several treasures that you can find in Spirit Tracks. I have a few theories about them, so let's get started. I want to start off with the Dragon Scale, because there's something about it that leaves me interested. Who left the Dragon Scale scattered all over New Hyrule? We could probably say that Valu, who granted the power of the Rito to fly, probably left his scales on on the Rito and that when they died his scales would be scattered or they would be left at or they'd be buried with the Rito. We know that the Rito probably went with Tetra and Link to the new Hyrule in Wind Waker as we see Medley on Tetra's pirate ship at the end of the game. However, this could be from another dragon that could be located in the new Hyrule that no one knows about, so that is still up for more theories. Another one I want to talk about is the Ruto Crown. The Zoras here in, Wind in, in Spirit Tracks are very hostile towards Link and will attack him at any time they catch sight of him. So this treasure could probably be from the peaceful Zoras who were once allies to the King of Old Hyrule. In other words, this crown probably came from the time of Old Hyrule before it was flooded. And we can say that the Rito could have them since the Rito are are theorized as descendants of the Zora of Old Hyrule. So, and this could have been worn by when the Rito still had royalty as they were the the descendants of the Zora. And they were And so they probably brought it over to the new Hyrule. But they probably died off when the Z when the hostile Zora warriors of the new Hyrule cast them off. Another one is the Goron Amber. We all know that the Gorons eat rocks, especially the rocks from Dodongo's cavern. But we never even heard of this one until Spirit Tracks. It is most likely that the Gorons from Old Hyrule, who were scattered across the Great Sea when the flood came probably brought this over to New Hyrule when they heard that Tetra and Link discovered it. Then, it, seeing as the Dark Ore Mine in Spirit Tracks is pretty far away from the Goron Village, they probably eat the rocks from there, and this is probably a very rare treat, considering it is only found a few times all over the game. So we can say that this is a very rare treat from Old Hyrule, to the Gorons of New Hyrule. The ancient gold piece is a, probably a piece probably given down by the elders of the New Hyrule who came from the old Hyrule or were survivors of the Great Flood. This gold piece is probably an, an, an acted as an artifact since rupees are the current currency in both New Hyrule and Old Hyrule. Probably the purpose of this piece as is it is a reminder of the old Hyrule as seen by the Triforce on the on the coin. This probably indicates that this piece comes from the Ocarina of Time era, where the Triforce has been mentioned plenty of times. While here in Spirit Tracks, there is no mention of the Triforce anywhere. In fact, the Triforce isn't mentioned at all, but only show, showed in symbols, as the main focus and the main, more like, more or less, de deities that are mentioned here are the Good Spirits and the Evil Demon King Miladis. So this is probably a reminder to the, to the old folk that came to the new Hyrule that there was once an old Hyrule and that the, tri the Triforce is still out there somewhere. Well, guys, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoy these my few theories. I'll be back again with the video soon. Thanks for watching.